Welcome back, everybody. Regular 13 signing on to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. In the last episode, I failed miserably so many times against Yetta. Now, hopefully, I'll be able to beat her. Let's do this. Well, I've, I'm already doing it. Uh, I'm just like, let's do this. It's just because I was explaining everything that happened in the previous episode, I'm... Uh, words. Okay, words. That's all I can say right now. Where is she? Where is she? Where is she? Like I've said three times before, crouching makes you go faster. And to crouch, you just press A, and then after that, let go of A, and you'll jump. Don't... Okay, good. Okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna win. I'm gonna win this time. No dying randomly. No random deaths. Why? Why do I keep dying such stupid deaths? You lose. I'm gonna destroy you, Jenna! Okay, this race is definitely gonna be the ra last race. Ready? Go! I'm gonna beat you, Jenna! I'm gonna throw bomb arrows at you, for God's sake. I can't select them! Link, your balance is not of importance. Killing Yetta is what is of, a por of importance right now. Shut up, Yetta. No one likes you. Freaking Yetta beating me at everything. Well, <laughs> not beating me at everything. I, I mean, like, beating me at snowboarding. I'm like, everything. Even at ping pong. That's right, I can't beat Yetta at ping pong. Or table tennis, as some would call it. I think table tennis and ping pong actually have different rules, but I'm not sure. Oh man, that reminds me, in Wii Sports Resort, they replace tennis with table tennis for whatever reason. It's the same mechanics, it's just... Why? Why can't you have both of them? Finally beat Yetta! But barely. Link, you too good, uh, I overconfident, maybe. You slimmer than husband, uh, hmm, maybe that's your secret, you are aerodynamic, um. You take this as token of respect for sled skills. You got a piece of heart. And no tell husband. You come back and race any time, uh. Finally. Now I can continue with the... Well, no, actually. There's something that you... There's something else that you can do after you beat the dungeon. It's... Uh, which way's quicker? I'd say this way's quicker. In fact, there's a shortcut to where I want to go in that place. Actually, I want to go to this direction. Um. <laughs> Transform into human. Now you, what you want to do is go through here. Come on, Link. Uh, na, na, na. And then through here, I already bombed the wall I needed to go through, so I can actually go through here. The Hyrule Field. 
Dun, 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 dun. A couple episodes I showed this, but I didn't know what to do because, well, I couldn't do anything. But now I can because I have the ball and chain and I could destroy ice. And a lot of people know this as the renowned Twilight Princess block puzzle. Why did I say renowned? It's renowned by everyone. Whoa. Anyway, right here. Bam. You can now enter the block puzzle. Okay, this puzzle right here. Simple. Easy peasy lemon a squeezy. Okay, oh, that would squish me. Okay. Here. Then there. Then right here. Now wait. Then right here. Push this, and push this. These puzzles take a little bit of common, like, not common sense, <laughs> like, um, a little bit of brain power to come up with the answer. I don't think this is the actual way you're supposed to do it, but, well, it's the answer I came up with, and it's the answer I'm staying with. Next door. Okay, let's check this puzzle out. Two switches this time. Derp, derp, derp. First switch is actually pretty easy. But i pretty sure... Actually, both of these switches are pretty easy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What am I doing? Push this here. Now this block is here. Press C by accident. Oh, t -t link move. Now I press that switch, at last. And that gate opened. Then I go here, t t t zinc! Stupid slippery ice physics friction. God, Link, get... Wait, I have iron boots. Do Are iron boots slippery? Nope, they're not, but they're still slow. Anyway, right here, and finally I've pressed all the switches. Next. Just one switch, and it's in a pretty far away area. No... Oh, God, I keep pressing... Put doing... There are only three of these puzzles? Weird, I thought there'd be like five. Anyway, they're not really that difficult. <laughs> Zelda Dungeon has its own walkthrough for it, and I don't even need it. <laughs> That's funny. Normally, I need to walk through for everything in a Zelda game. I don't think that was smart. Actually, yes, this was smart. No, wait. 
Now, how do I... Hmm. Hmm, this one's actually pretty tough. Brain puzzles. I hope the time limit doesn't run out by the time I finish this. That would stink. I'm pushing this here. Because I can. Hmm. I'm getting stuck all over the place here. Just when I said these puzzles were easy, they turned hard. I even said this one was actually the easiest one, but no, I'm wrong. I got two of these lined up here. I think this won't help me at all. But what happens if I... Oh wait, I'm such a... Oh, After I... I'm supposed to do these. Th I mean, these. I'm supposed to do these. These is what I am supposed to do. Then I'm supposed to put this here. And this goes here. Then this one goes here. Oh no, wait, wrong way. This one goes here. And this one goes here. And this one goes here. And then this one goes here. And now I rotate this one back to over here. Back over here. Right over here. Ending it off over here. And finishing a right over here. That was actually much easier than I thought and then I made it look. Piece of heart, one more and I get a heart container. I guess it's okay for me to leave now, hopefully. Please? Actually, I just remembered um, the golden bugs in um, Gerudo Meza. I'm gonna go get those right now. Right here. Come on, get it. You got the female day fly. And finally, over here, we have... Oh, let me just get to it before the end of this video. Oh, no, no. Link, get it! There we go. A uh, male day dayfly. Oh, well. That's it for now. Next episode, gonna continue with the main quest. Package 13, signing out.